L look, man, uh, we just need to make a quick stop before we go to the party, so... Dude, is this Big Papa Joe's house? Uh, yeah. What the fuck, man? I thought you were gonna stop this shit. Look, man, it's just, oh. like I said, it's a quick stop. We'll only be here for a second, and... Dude, you can't be serious. Don't you remember the fucking intervention we threw for you? I had to call this guy and that guy. We all had to come together, pretend like we fucking cared about you. I know, man. I'm sorry. Dude, I had to spend one hour, one fucking hour in the bathroom, waving an onion under your mother's eye to get the bitch to squirt. Oh, look, I know, I know. I'm sorry. Run that by me one more time. Shit. What's going on, man? Hello. How are you? What's your name, big fella? Bob. Bob? Yeah. Good for you. Is this for you? What? Thank you. And I do believe this is for you. Thank you, sir. Enjoy that. I will. Look, Bob, I'm really sorry you have to see this. You know, I just, I don't want you to think that... I mean, the intervention was great, it was... I really, it hit me, man, 100%. Last fucking time, I promise you, alright? Last time. Last fucking time, promise. So you don't do this? Who? Me? No. Why not? Um, I just don't. Would you like to? No, no. Come on. Look, I'll give you from my own personal stash. This is the shit I'm gonna be doing tonight. I will let you partake. It's alright, man. Uh Are you going to refuse me? In my own home, you are going to turn down my generosity. No, no, hey, 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 it's cool, it's cool, I'll do it, whatever. Well, there it is. No, 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 pants stay down, pants stay down, because I want your balls hanging out while we have the conversation we're about to have. When I'm done telling you what I have to tell you, I'm gonna look down, and I expect to see the two biggest pair of balls I have ever seen in my life. I expect to see two bowling balls in a flesh satchel. That's what I expect to see, because... Give me a second.
first of all. I have no idea how it was you did what you did. In other circumstances, I'd probably be curious as to how it is that you did what you did. No, no, as a matter of fact, I'm really fucking curious right now because as far as I'm concerned, that's not humanly goddamn possible. That's not my primary concern right now. I have other pressing concerns right now. Like, I don't know, the fact that $300 of my cocaine is now sitting in your asshole. And that's probably the least of it. That's the table all my customers do their lines off of. More importantly, that's the table I do my fucking lines off of. And I have to put my nose where your ass has been. I have to put these precious nostrils of mine where your ass has been. Do you realize that? Your ass is never gonna wash off this table. Never will I be able to look at this fucking table without seeing the sight of two man-ass cheeks pressed up against it. Do you realize that? Never mind that, I'm never gonna be able to do coke again fucking period because of this shit. This is literally goddamn traumatizing for me. You've blown, blown my goddamn mind. I mean, next time I go to do coke off the surface, I'm gonna have to think, has an ass been there before me? Shit, if you can snort through your ass, maybe some guy out there can snort through his fucking dick. And maybe he was the last guy to use that surface. Now I have to think about that fucking shit because of you. And now I have to be fearful that I'm gonna put my nostrils where a dick has been. Is that, is that a fucking, a natural concern for a coke dealer? Should I have to be worrying about putting my nose where a dick is? Is that a concern any human being should have? Can you tell me? So let's see, $300 worth of cocaine, a new table, therapy sessions, in just 10 seconds. 10 seconds you have cost me upwards of $5,000 in damages. I mean, seriously, dude, what the fuck? What the fuck? What did I do to you? You come into my home and you fucking do this to me. I mean, God damn you, man. I say that as sincerely as one human being can say that to another. May God damn you. I realize a drug dealer isn't gonna be in the best standing with the Lord to be asking much, but, 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 but fuck it, because you know what? I don't want the help of any god who's gonna befit a man with the capability of snorting my cocaine through his asshole in the first place. I mean, seriously, man. Even if you knew you had the capability of doing that, what could possibly compel you to do that here? What would make you think that that is something that is polite to do in front of company? I'm gonna go watch Friends. You can keep some of that if you want. If you can. I don't I don't want it back, so.